Good morning guys, so as you can see we're literally all packing up now, bed, we've been good, and yeah, last day, so sad, so we're just going to chill today, get some food and go to the airports, they're going to a different airport than me, I've got a good airport, because I've got British Airways. I don't even say a good airport though, it's not really a plane. Not the airport. The airport can be shit. Yeah, Ryanair flew to that airport you're flying from. Ah, still. Anyway, yeah, we're let's, not let's finish packing and let's go to the airport. Hey guys, so we're literally just waiting for Alex, the guy who showed us this place, um, I think he owns it, to come back and check us out, give us the security deposit back, and then we're going to get some food. And then we're going to the airport. So, so yeah, we'll see you. When we're oh yeah. There. David keeps interrupting because he thinks it's funny, but it's not. Nah. Anyway, let's go. And we are leaving, guys. Don't get run over. We are leaving. Bye bye. Weird sign. Yeah, we are going to get some food at McDonald's. And then we're going to our separate airports. And I won't see them until we're back in Manchester then. Hallelujah. Get lost, you'll miss me. Messing each messaging each other before on the and before on the plane. You might be able to see them. Yeah. Anyway, so let's go get some food. Food acquired. I didn't get much because I'm trying to use the last of my money. I haven't got much. Let's see, it's a one burger. Oh, well, is that it? Yeah. Oh, well, oh, that's not bad. Yeah, Big Mac. Was it a Big Mac or? Uh, McChicken. McChicken, chips, and a drink. Chips and a drink. What did not do I see you? Oh, well. Let's go. You sad, Marty. I miss you. Just a tip. Just a tip. <laughs> so this is what David got. So Matty got that. I got you know that. Nice, nice, easy, cheap meals. David got two meals. How much did it cost you? Like four pounds. Four pounds. Four pounds for two meals. Okay. Slightly better. But yeah. Wow, that's insane. So this is how much David got. He got all those fries. And then a chicken, milk chicken, and nine chicken nuggets as well. <laughs> You could if you could afford it. <laughs> yeah. Let's be honest, I had to sub you some money to afford that. Yeah, he's like two, which is what, like a penny? And in fairness, they didn't give me a penny. Yeah. So. Still have to one penny, Yeah. Anyway, hope you enjoy it, bud. Looks oh, yeah. good. Hello. Oh, no, no. Shoot. You got some <laughs> <laughs> But this guy's going round. He's asking for food. As you've seen, he's just he just came to us. David gave him a chip and he won't go away for like 20 minutes. Well I've got enough to go around, so. So yeah, he's he's literally just begging. I gave him the taste of it. Now he knows what he wants more. Wow. Yeah. So we'll be there, and we'll be on the plane back home. It's weird being not being with David and my. It's really weird, but it's, it's kind of nice. A bit of freedom, a bit of peace and quiet. Anyway, I'll see you when we get to the airport. We've arrived. We've arrived. Good time. Yeah. 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 Next stop. Ooh, we'll check in just wherever. I'm through security. Finally, and um, checked in. Bag's gone. She's got this one, and now we've got passport control and to a gate because boarding starts in about 20 minutes. So let's go. So I've made it through security just now, and my gate is actually boarding. I think uh, 30. Yeah, my plane is boarding, so we need to go quickly to the gate. Let's sort of run right there. Let's go British Airways. Time to spare. We're using a jetway for once, which is nice. 
Right, and I never used them. Wow, looks good. Wow, looks good. Let's go, British Airways. Happy. Up to David and Matthew. They're still at the airport because their flight doesn't board yet. Let's go. I'm happy. I'm happy. I will meet them in Manchester. Let's go, guys. Right. We're going to the train. I'm happy. Yeah. One plane. Yeah. It's not that busy, to be honest. So I might get the whole aisles myself, but I doubt it. Yeah. Nice view out of the plane. The wing. Let's go back to England. We're off about 10 minutes early. So everybody is on board, which is great to see. And the DI has the wings later. So I'll show you that bit. I've got my neck pillow again. Nobody's there. I've got a whole road to myself. Great. David, Matty, this is how you do it. In style.
approaching quarter past three in the afternoon. Please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened. The fast seatbelt sign has been switched off. You may now make a receive calls for the sheets or data service. We have made it to London Heathrow. It's awesome and I'm very happy I'm here. So next thing, let's go sort out where we need to go to get the Manchester one. I've got some time to lay over so let's just have a look around and chill. So I'm kind of lost in Heathrow. Um, I followed the signs for like Terminal 4 or something. No, Terminal 5 air gates because that's where my gate is. So I'm slowly walking there but yeah. Not exactly sure where I'm going. So yeah, this is interesting. It just goes on and on. Look, it just goes on and on and on. It's immense. And yeah, it's absolutely immense. That goes all the way down to C gates, all the way down to A gates. People are in a rush. Don't get why. So yeah, I'm trying to work it out. I'm going there. So let's go. I think next stop I'm gonna do is food because I only ate that McDonald's I didn't eat anything on the plane because it was stupidly overpriced and yeah it just wasn't very nice um, and like none of the food was nice so yeah um, let's go find some food I'm walking here I see this thing coming up and I realized I could have asked for a lift I'm an idiot we could have asked for a lift. Did not even bother to offer. Oh, for God's sake, can you see me walking all this way? So there was absolutely nothing I could see that did uh, transfer, which is a bit annoying. Even though I did follow the signs, but we're just going to have to do this again. Oh well. It's not like I'm pressed for time. Let's go. Yes, get you prepared for all the madness. Made it through Heathrow. Get in. Um, and next things, next is find somewhere to eat. So let's go. Uh, security wasn't that bad, um, which was good. So yeah, we're just gonna go find something to eat now. So I am still on the hunt for food. Found a Weatherspoon's back there, so I might go to that if I don't find anything. But I don't want to spend super money. I just want something like cheap and cheerful, like a McDonald's or a KFC or something like that. Great. So yeah, let's try find something. So, found food, finally. Um, I have found other spoons. It's easy, it's cheap, I'm happy. Uh, couldn't find any KFC or all like that, so it's fine. It's just so busy here. So I'm gonna go order food, and I'll come back and tell you what I've got. Myself a pint of strong First in the departure bar, so my flight is... Where is it? Oh, where is it then? Found it, my phone is there. 7.05 Manchester. Good, I'm happy. So I've got myself a, got myself a oh, burger, and it's a very big burger. So I'm happy, I'm excited, can't wait. It's gonna be good. So I'll show you when it arrives. It has arrived. Two six ounce burgers with cheese, bacon, oh beautiful, and my pilot stronger. Look at this burger, look how good it looks. Give me a sec. Oh, it's good, it's very good. Let's put you down there. Oh. Mm. That's really good. It's two six ounce burgers. Stunning. And I'll show you what it's like at the end.
Hey guys, so I have left Weatherspoons. Um, sorry I'm not vlogging tons, I've just got a massive headache. Uh, I'm going to actually go to WH Express and get something, because, yeah. Mm. Yeah, so, I'm going to go get something, because I've got a massive headache. Uh, I'm going to maybe even try to find a quiet lounge and just chill there. Because just noises do, like, I can't, noises just hurt my head so much. So, anyway, um, I spoke to David just now, they're fine, they're in Warsaw, they've got like a long layover like me. So they're just waiting. Um, and hopefully they don't get delayed or I'll be waiting for them for a while. Anyway, um, let's go get some headache stuff. Hey guys, so I went to the Bureau at Smith's and it was too expensive, it was like five pounds for a small pack. I'm not paying that, I'll suffer for a bit. Get something when I get home, go to sleep. So yeah, it's not worth it. But our gate's just been announced, so I am walking to my gate and then getting on the plane and getting back home. Uh, as I said, I spoke to David there. Their plane's on the way and then they'll be coming back home to Manchester too. So we'll see them when we land. Well, we'll see them when I land and then hang around for a bit. So see you guys in a sec when we get to the gate. So I'm at the gate now, as you can see. It's not closing. It's like four people away in queue. Not queuing until it's like nobody. We started here chilling. So, I'm not rushing. Sit here, chill. Never understand why people stand up and wait. I'd rather sit down, relax, stretch my feet, and then go on the plane. So, I'll see you guys when I'm on the plane. I am on board. I'm happy. Still got a headache, but I'm just powering through. I might go out of Manchester, get some some and then go back in and meet David and my. So, yeah. Slowly. It's only a shot of flight, so that's good. So, without further ado, let's go.
like not actually filming getting off the plane, but I actually was sick on the plane, um, just as, as I was getting off. Uh, so I was literally the last person off the plane, and I was sick, so um, sorry about not filming that. I'm just waiting to get my bag in front of me. Still not feeling great, but I'm going to try to go outside, get some fresh air, get some water, and just try to get feel a bit better, but yeah, I just feel terrible. Um, so, next thing, just waiting to get back, and then pass out for a bit and some work for David and Matthew. So, after some water and some Nurofen, I'm feeling a bit better. My headache's gone slowly, and now I'm just waiting for David and Matty. And it's snowing, which is quite cool to see. Um, yeah, so we'll show you when they're arriving. So, I'm feeling a lot better now, which is good. Um, wasn't feeling better. So, you know, I thought, you know, in honour of my friends coming back, I thought I'd, you know, make a sign so they wouldn't realise. Mr. Lonely, dickhead, aka Mr. Rich, aka Mr. Stupid. It's the other way around, but it, yeah. Give me a sec. I'd make this sign for them. It's some of the uh, chat names that we have, like nicknames in our messenger. So that was Matty, Mr. Lonely, because he was sat on his, pl on his own on the plane and stupid because he can be a bit stupid and David, dickhead which is what I always call him and Mr. Rich because he's rich well I always joke that he's rich yeah, David's flight's just landed sign ready this is going to be funny mm -hmm. keep laughing at it which makes me laugh <laughs> waiting for him let's go oh, hello oh. Sign the sign. I was like, wait, what? Where is the missile? Aka stupid and dickhead. Aka three. <laughs> where did you get the time and energy to make that? Where did you get the time from? There's a sign over there. Oh, that's, wow. Do you like it? <laughs> I was like, hey, where is it? I didn't notice it then. You like it? Love it. Oh, it's amazing. I'll let you keep it. No, down this way. So, I finally found them, as you saw, which was great. I'm happy to see them again, ish. That was like one, that was their plane there. So yeah. Uh, God, it's cold. It's just the wind. Right, cross over, cross over, cross over. Give me a second. Yeah, so I'm happy I've seen them again. Hi <laughs> there, I missed your vlog. <laughs> so. Um, this is the end of the holiday. It's been really sad because I've absolutely loved it. It's been an awesome holiday. Thank you. Um, I, I love my sign, which, as you saw, um, it was it was a great holiday. I loved it so much. Chernobyl, Auschwitz. I just all the jokes for these guys. It's been awesome. So anyway, so anyway, well hopefully see you on another adventure i'm not sure when it's gonna be might be a karting one but it, in fact, it will be a karting yeah. one hopefully i'm gonna be bringing you guys a new track which is the bradford track he's gonna be there next week so i will link him down below like i do in all my videos <laughs> um to his channel go check him out like subscribe and like subscribe to me have a good day. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.